Here's what the pillars of creation look like in three dimensions. Data from the very large telescope in Chile suggests that it would be more appropriate to call the Eagle Nebula's famous gas formation the Pillars of Destruction. Researchers have been able to map how the Eagle Nebula's pillars of creation are distributed in three-dimensional space for the first time, using new data from the multi-unit spectroscopic explorer instrument on the European Southern Observatory's very large telescope in Chile. Given the tremendous size of this section of the Eagle Nebula and its distance from Earth, around 7,000 light-years, Researchers previously thought we were unlikely to ever see the shape of it in anything other than to flat dimensions as in Hubble's famous photograph. The Eagle Nebula is a region rich in stellar formation, with the cluster NGC 6611, between 1 million and 2 million years old and containing the hot, bright blue O-type and B-type stars at its heart. As these new stars formed, stellar winds tore at the surrounding gas carving out the iconic shape of the pillars, where the dense pockets of dust and gas inside resisted the erosive forces. The three tall fingers stretch out into space, the longest of which measures some four light years, 